Welcome to our lecture online. What we have here in front of us is an example where we have an object, in this case a small fish, in a fish bowl. Of course, this is water. Index of refraction is 1.33. On the outside, we have air. Index of refraction is 1. And notice that the radius of the fish bowl, which is a spherical fish bowl, is equal to 10 centimeters. And the distance from the fish, the object, to the edge, the boundary between the air and the water, we can ignore the glass because it's very thin, is 8 centimeters. So now the image will appear where? That's the question. We're trying to find S prime. We're going to utilize this equation right here, which tells us that the relation between N1, N2, S, S prime, and R can be found using that equation. So let's plug everything in that we know. N1 is 1.33. That's the same index of refractions where the object is at. So 1.33 divided by 8, which is the distance from the object to the boundary, plus N2, which is 1, divided by S prime, which is what we're looking for, which is equal to N2, which is 1, minus N1, which is 1.33, divided by the radius of curvature of the boundary, which is 10. Now, is it a positive 10 or negative 10? The way we determine that is we want to look at it from the perspective of the object. Is the surface convex or concave? Well, convex it would be like this, concave it's like this relative to the object. If it's concave relative to the object, it's a negative r, it's a negative radius of curvature. All right, now we're ready to find S prime. Moving this to the other side, simplifying this, we get 1 over S prime is equal to 1 minus 1.33 is minus 0 0.33 divided by minus 10. So it looks like the negatives will cancel out. And then minus 1.33 divided by 8. Simplifying that a little bit more, we have 1 over S prime is equal to 0 0.33 divided by 10 minus 1.33 divided by 8. And a common denominator would be 40. So this becomes 4 times this, that would be 6, that's 1, that would be 1.33 divided by 40, minus 5 times that, that would be 5, that would be 6.67 divided by 40. I think I did that right, but let's get a calculator and verify. So now we subtract one from the other. So we have 1.33 minus 6.67 divided by 40. And now we need to take the inverse of that. So when we take the inverse, we get uh, 7.5 or S prime is equal to a negative 7.50 centimeters. So what does that mean? Well, the negative means that the image is on the same side as the object and that it's 7.5 centimeters away from the boundary, which means that the image is just a little bit closer. There we go. There's the image of the little fish. And you can see that this distance from there to there, S prime is equal to a minus 7.5 centimeters when S was equal to 8 centimeters. So it puts the image just a little bit closer, about a half centimeters closer to the boundary. Negative means it's on the same side as the object, and that's how it's done.